Morning and welcome back. If you're looking for a date through an app or online, there's a romance scam we want to warn you about. Con artists are offering to pay your bills by becoming your sugar mama or sugar daddy. Leah Napoliello with Better Business Bureau Texas is joining us live to explain how to protect ourselves from this scam. Uh, Leah, this is really disturbing to hear people are capitalizing on this. Yeah, unfortunately, we're seeing that situation where they're claiming that they will pay your expenses and give you a monthly allowance or weekly allowance. But of course, it's one of those deals that if it sounds too good to be true, that it probably is. So you don't want to fall for that type of thing. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, explain to us how this scam works. And we know a lot of people, uh, especially in 2024, are looking for dates online, dating apps. It's, it's hard at first to possibly vet these people. Right. So they will approach you and say on, when you go on the dating apps and they'll say that they will pay your expenses and it sounds like it's wonderful. But of course, um, they will not do that. They instead send you a fake check and you don't realize it at first. So you take the money, you spend it, and then they'll ask for a portion of that money back. And then it's your own money. So the bank maybe doesn't catch immediately that it is a fake check. So when you're sending the money back to the scammer, it's your own money that you're sending back. So it really puts you in a bad situation. And of course, this, this happens after days of exchanging and, 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 and feelings are beginning to develop. And so this person is looking forward to meeting, having a relationship with this individual. Yes, they can be very persuasive. They know how to, to really trap people and hook them. So they yeah. will be, be coming on very strong, saying this is love at first sight, and really know how to tug at your emotions. So you have to watch out for that, too. If someone's going too strong, too fast on these dating apps, then that is a red flag. Yeah, absolutely. How can someone protect themselves if a sugar mama or sugar daddy is asking for money or any personal information? At what point is it appropriate to, I, I, I would say, never to give money out? Uh, I don't know. That would be a turnoff for me if someone is asking for money and I, I necessarily didn't meet them. But w what should people do in, in these types of situations? We do recommend that you're right, that you should not give out any personal information or money to someone that you've just met online, especially if you haven't even had a video chat with this person. They're basically a stranger to you. So you want to keep all that sensitive information safe and protected and don't divulge it to a stranger that you've only just met online and don't give any money to them either. Yeah, and you know, sadly, uh, we so often see not only do, do these relationships take place online, but sometimes these con artists, th they will meet these individuals that they've, they've connected with on these dating apps. You meet the person, you go out on a few dates with them, and they're still conning you and you're not aware. Right, that can happen too. So you have to be very careful and research the people that you meet on these apps too. So mm -hmm. look into their background, see what you can find online, if there's any using fake photos, for instance. So take some time to research them and ask them questions, you know, to see if that might trip them up about their background. And if they're being vague or anything like that, then that is uh, should raise some red flags for you. Yeah, definitely. And then, of course, if you do fall victim to uh, this scam or a scam similar, uh, reach out to authorities, but also let the BBB know. Right, exactly. We have a scam tracker service where you can report scams to us, and that helps to warn the public about these types of scams so other people will not fall victim to them. Leah Napoliello with the BBB, thank you so much for your time this morning. We appreciate it. Sure, thank you for having me.